Introduction of Post-Brexit ID Cards Chances of introduction of identity cards post-Brexit may be possible, according to the United Kingdom Immigration Minister. Have you visited our website? We have hundreds of updates regarding UK visa and immigrations. Also, if you haven't subscribed the channel, please subscribe now, and press the bell icon, to get the latest updates on your screens. Caroline Noakes proposes identity cards as reply to residence rules once free movement finishes. Ministers may well possibly think through some form of post-Brexit ID card scheme for the United Kingdom, the Immigration Minister has stated, mentioning this will be an answer to the absolute difficulty of residence rules when free movement terminates. Providing proof to the European Union Home Affairs Subcommittee in the House of Lords, Caroline Noakes mentioned about certain problems could ascend in the occurrence of a no-deal Brexit as there would be seven distinct methods under which European Union citizens could lawfully be in the United Kingdom. She further informed the committee, I very much expect that we do not but I'm aware that we may well finish off in our no-deal position. Noakes describing herself a fan of free movement, further stated, we are putting a stop to free movement, which is what we have decided to do, because of the very strong objective we would provided by the British citizens in the referendum of 2016. It is more confused and there are no two modes about that. Caroline Noakes was inquired about identity cards by Timothy Kirkhope, a conservative associate who was an immigration minister in John Major's leadership. The immigration minister stated that the image had surfaced at some point in discussions with parties signifying European Union citizens in the United Kingdom, many approached from nations where identity cards are common. We are from a diverse values where identity cards have for no reason been the British way she revealed. But at times individuals can make quite powerful, noteworthy claims to me about ID cards. Noakes further mentioned that she directly resisted the concept, adding, nevertheless, it has been very obvious to me over the passage of the past few discussions that we've had about immigration in the Commons, from the confirmation sittings for the Immigration Bill Committee, that there is a developing body of belief on this, I can't offer into the Commons without someone shouting at me, isn't it occasion you presented ID cards? So it's not our policy, it is not what I wish to do. But certainly in the case of EU citizens who might in their home member state have been used to them, I can see that there is some argument in favor. Under prior inquiring from the crossbench peer Peter Ricketts, Noakes acknowledged a Brexit with no deal would carry precise difficulty in calculating whether or not European Union citizens had the right to stay in the United Kingdom. Ricketts stated that he had calculated six methods under which individuals could remain in the United Kingdom, if there were no deal, indefinite leave to remain, settled status, pre-settled status, transitional one-year visa, European temporary leave to remain for three years, and three months without leave. Noakes settled and inserted a seventh, individuals who were lawfully in the United Kingdom before parting under free movement and had not applied for any successive approval to remain. This all entailed, she stated, that it was certainly essential the United Kingdom had an exit deal with the transitional phase. Noakes further stated that any post-Brexit prosecution rule would be light touch, and grant for the fact that the procedure had transformed noticeably, 